In this video, we will talk about how to remove Microsoft Copilot and we have done deep down research behalf of you by adding all the possible solution to remove Microsoft Copilot. So watch the complete video. Method 1. Remove Copilot. Click on Windows icon. From here, you need to select Settings. On the left hand side, select Apps. Click on Installed Apps. Here in search, you can type Copilot or either if you can see Copilot, simply click on three dots and select Uninstall. Again, click on Uninstall. This will uninstall the Copilot from your PC. Method 2. Local Group Policy If you are a Windows Home user, then this method will not work for you. So you can skip to Method 3. Click on Windows icon, type Run, select Open. Here you need to type this command gpedit.msc click on ok once you'll be in local group policy in user configuration click on the arrow of administrative templates now open the windows components here you need to search for windows copilot here you can see that now on the right hand side you can see that you have an option of turn off windows copilot double click on it if you want to see the information you can read from here, simply select enable and from here you can click on apply and ok. Method 3. Registry Editor. Click on Windows icon, type registry, select run as administrator, click yes. First you need to make sure that you will make the backup of your registry editor. So click on file and select export. Select the location and you can give the name of your registry, backup. From here, make sure you select the desktop, click on save and this will backup all of your registry. Alright, now you can see that we have a backup of our registry. After doing that, you need to be in a location. So let me enter that location. You have to be in HKEY current user. Then you have to click on software folder. Afterward, expand the folder of policy, Microsoft. Once you'll be in Windows folder, let me show you here. I have added that information in the description. So you can copy this location from the description and from there you can paste that in the registry editor. Do a right click. From here, select new and select key and you need to give the name to your folder Windows Copilot and make sure the W have to be in capital and C have to be in capital. After creating the folder of Windows Copilot, on the right hand side, do a right click, select new and select D word 32 bit value. Click on it. Here you need to name it turn off Windows Copilot and make sure the first letter have to be in capital. And after that, double click on it. Now change the value from zero to one. Click on OK and close it. I hope our method will help you to remove the Microsoft Copilot. That's all for today. Meet you on the next video.